fear. Fear. Is that what's stopping you from starting your own business? Well, we're going to talk about it when we get back. I'm CLM2 for With Power, the channel that helps find the power within you. He's giving me power, all power, all power. Hey, happy Monday, everyone. We hope everyone out there had a fantastic weekend. Uh, we did have some snow this past weekend. It was just a little bit of snow. And uh, of course, the cold weather is here. It's been freezing over the last week in the tri-state area. So we hope everybody out there is keeping warm. And wherever you are, we hope that you're, uh, you're keeping warm. Um, so today, I'm going to continue my series about starting your own business. And as you know, I'm putting together videos so that those of you who uh, go and download my free ebook, join my email list, and um, you will be the first to be able to get a crack at these videos from soup to nuts, how to start your own business. So I'll talk a little bit about a name and um, talk a little bit about what type of business structure you may want to have. So today's video, short and sweet, we're going to talk about fear. F-E-A-R, fear. Is that what's stopping you from starting your own business? Fear. A lot of people are afraid for some reason. Uh, you know what? Let's look up the definition of fear. I have it right here. So the definition of fear, an unpleasant emotion caused by the belief that someone or something is dangerous, likely to cause pain or a threat. Mm. A belief that someone or something is dangerous. You know, they have an acronym for fear, F-E-A-R, false evidence appearing real. Remember when we were kids and they used to tell us that there were, you know, there was the boogeyman in the closet or the boogeyman underneath the bed. And as we got older, we realized there was no one in the closet. There was no one underneath the bed, right? False evidence appearing real. It seemed real, but it wasn't real. I think that's what happens with a lot of people when it's time to start their own business. You know, they ask me questions, they say, Cliff, um, you know, where do I start? How do I start? Um, you know, what if I fail? You know, what if things don't go right? Where, where am I going to get the money from to start my own business? Um, you, know, what, you know, what are you supposed to do? How do you make it legal? All these questions, and then they start doubting themselves, and then they say they get afraid to just start. And it's all because of fear. You know, believing that something is dangerous and it's causing the threat, but it, you know, there's no danger in starting your own business. Millions and millions of people have started businesses over the years, and you know what? If it doesn't work out for you, you just keep going. You start another business. Nothing to be afraid of. And I know it's easier said than done. Believe me, when I started my first business, you know, I was afraid also. I didn't know what, what to expect. I didn't know, know what to do. But you know, I learned from my mentors and the people that I trusted that, you know what? You just got to get started. You just got to do it. You know, it's, um, it's, like that old, um, it's like that old saying, a young man asks an old wise man, how do I get to the top of Mount Everest? And the old wise man says, just put one foot in front of the other and just keep walking until you get to the top of Mount Everest. So simple, right? But that's really how it works. That's really what you have to do. You have to reduce it down to the most simplest, minute things possible. How do you get to the top of Mount Everest? You put one foot in front of the other and you keep walking until you get to the top. Same thing with business. 
you just take your time, you put one foot in front of the other. And you have people like me who have started many of businesses and um, I'm here to show you. I'm here to tell you the little things that you have to know. I'm getting to these little things little by little. Names, structure, now how to get over the fear of doing something, you know. And we're gonna make it happen for you because I strongly believe in this type of climate, now we're in the pandemic uh, climate. I'll tell you my story, if you go back, I'll tell you my story about when 9-11 hit and the world stopped and I was in between jobs. Luckily, I had started my own business in the music industry and I had stacks of money, so I was okay. We were in a pandemic, you know, you know people have lost jobs. Right now, you have to pay back rent if you owe rent, mortgages. You have to start your own business so you can at least have a backup. You can at least be able to stack some money. Fear. Don't let fear stop you. Put one foot in front of the other and let's make it happen. Well, that's it. So, like I said, uh, hopefully you like the information. You know, go and subscribe to the channel. Definitely go to my website, www dot cliffordlmarshall.com download the free ebook 21 money making businesses you can start right now and um, you know join my email list you'll be the first one to get a crack at these videos that I'm creating right now on how to start your business going from soup to nuts making it happen all right hope that made sense so listen as I always say I will see you next time.